A neighborhood is on edge tonight in Palm Harbor after a woman had to run from her home because the walls started cracking. She even called 911 for help. Something's happening in my house. The molding is coming down off the ceiling. There's cracking going on and everything. That woman also found cracks in the foundation of her home. She is staying with neighbors tonight. As of right now, there is no confirmation that a sinkhole is to blame, but engineers have been called out. So the whole community wants to know, is this depression something they should be worried about? Nightside reporter Sarah Rosario is live in the neighborhood tonight. She's been working to figure out how you can spot a possible sinkhole. But first, Sarah, has anything really changed since you got there? Yeah, Carolina, well, we can't tell you how much this depression has changed since earlier this afternoon. That was the last time that there was an official update on what officials are calling this thing a depression here. But here's what we can tell you. The homeowner who lives here, a 76 year old woman, she was forced to evacuate her home, is now wrapped in this yellow caution tape you see here. And there's also signs like this one that you see above the garage. It says it's unsafe, warning people to stay away. Many people, many neighbors came to me with questions. Also, many people on Facebook Live. And so tonight I went to get answers. Reports of cracks at this Palm Harbor home have officials saying it's now unlivable. I can't call, open and close doors. I'm seeing there's even cracks outside in the foundation. Forcing 76 year old Teresa Relo out of her home. Engineers checked neighbor Helen Berg's house and found nothing, but she's still concerned. I couldn't fall asleep the rest of the night. Officials can't say whether it's a sinkhole until engineers come to check it out. A little tense. Um, worried. We're supposed to be going on a cruise Sunday and uh, we'd hate to leave the house. Neighbor Joyce Gordon showed us this crack in her bathroom but says it's been there for a while. So should these neighbors be worried? USF engineering professor and sinkhole expert Nick Albergo says no unless they start seeing bigger cracks or a shift in foundation. More than just hairline cracks. If their windows or doors aren't opening correctly anymore where they're sticking might suggest some displacement of some sort. While we all know what sinkholes look like, depressions cause less concern. You have these small areas where you see a dip and you'll see them all over the state of Florida. But left with many questions, neighbors are ready to evacuate, remaining hopeful the depression won't spread to their home too. If they said you better leave, we have no problem doing that. Yeah, Catalina, so for, for people asking if they're worried about a depression or a sinkhole inside their home, all they need to do is check their home for cracks. Also check with your insurance company to see if this is covered. Right now, in this case, the county is waiting on this homeowner's insurance company to get an engineer to come out here to see if the home can be repaired or if it is, in fact, unlivable. And Catalina, we'll be sure to keep everybody updated as soon as we get the latest developments on this case. Yeah, and of course, we'll have that posted on our website, WTSP.com. And if you head over there right now, you can can read more information about recognizing the early signs of a sinkhole and how they form.